for we are to God the fragrance of Christ. 2 Corinthians 2 verse 15. Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Tokwe and this is Top Notes by Tokwe. So if today is the first time you see my face, I'm a fragrance reviewer from Lagos, Nigeria and I'll be elated if you subscribe to the channel. Today in the video, I have some fragrances, quite a number of them, about 20 that I want to share with you. We are in March, today is the first day of March and I thought why don't I share the fragrances that I have that will be perfect for spring so if you're interested in knowing which fragrance i have here on the lineup without much ado let's get into the video welcome to the video so like i said if you're not subscribed please click the subscribe button turn on the notification bell so that you are always notified when i upload a new video so today i have my spring lineup these are inexpensive affordable fragrances that are perfect for spring you know you're just coming out of winter you need something light something fresh fruity musky i got you on that so let's start with the first fragrance so the first fragrance that i have for you right here is amir al al arab yes by asdaf so amir al arab by asdaf here is a very nice fruity yeah so it's strawberry it's a bit of jasmine it's floral it's fruity it's light and it's so beautiful it has a bit of like a uh, girly um, um you know feel to it and it's super 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 beautiful for the sp the spring you know it's it's a nice way to you know refresh yourself and you know cleanse your nose after you've used all those thick heavy scents for winter this is really beautiful this has um, a medium to average projection in fact most of the fragrances i'm going to talk about today have medium to average projection because they are mostly floral fruity musky kind of scent so they have medium to average projection they have the same also for sillage and then longevity yeah a few may last much longer but most of them last four to five hours so that's the longevity on this one four to five hours but i think that for the price you can always reapply and it's not so expensive so it's amirat al arab from asdaf okay the next one that i have is one from al arab um yes al rehab and this is nebras someone mentioned that nebras was um a gucci yes i think gucci crash um dupe but i'm not sure i don't know if it was nebras I don't think it was Nebras, it was another one. So Nebras is a beautiful floral powdery scent. It has rose in it, it has some jasmine. It's very powdery, very floral, very beautiful. It's and it's the kind of scent that you want to start off spring with. It smells like a nice garden, very, very beautiful. It doesn't have sweetness to it. I'm trying to find to put it on skin too. It doesn't have so mm -mm. It doesn't have sweetness to it there's some vanilla and some um, um raising in it that grounds it very well and maybe amber but nebras this is what it looks like but al rehab is beautiful and it's a nice way for you to start your spring in the same vein there's another one this is um dalau yeah da dalau da lao. so dalau is again from al rehab this is like um it's like it's nice it has this caramelness to it but to my nose is like a caramel floral so this could be for early spring when you know it's not yet super you know the the winter hasn't gone yet but you know you need something in between dalal is very beautiful some people get a lot of gourmand from it but to me it smells like a candied floral so like a candied jasmine or a candid white floral most of the time some blossom and i think it makes it very appropriate this is one that pushes has um it has a moderate projection and moderate sillage but for longevity this lasts a bit longer i don't know if it's the color but this goes five to maybe seven hours on the skin it, the first hour it projects for maybe the first hour and a half to yeah two hours but it's really beautiful you can see that i enjoy it this you know this is just one usage i really draw put my put it on a lot it's really nice so that's dalau for you the next that i have i'm going to go into 
um latafa's um pure mask this is very very beautiful for those really cool days if you're looking for for those of you that like that clean fresh you know spa kind of smell this is it this is pure mask i like this one too i'm, I'm not this was my first introduction to mask based scents because i'm not a fan of mask based scents but this one i used it um in ghana one time and i really yep so this mask and some very light floral and a bit of um yeah light floral i'm looking more white florals jasmine maybe something like carnation in it but very light very very light and refreshing and but i think that the ingredient says just mask but there's this floral undertone that goes on with it that's so beautiful and i love these beads in it i don't know if um you can see but there are these beads that you know play around in it really cool the next mask base that i'll give you is um oud mood mask mood okay by latafa it looks like oud mood this one too was the next this one i bought i sold and then i bought again because i wasn't i don't know i wanted to give when i started enjoying mask i thought that i should give this one a chance again so yeah this has a fruity floral musky base it has like a citrus floral musky base very beautiful very nice for both spring and summer but i think it's a very nice way to start into light and fresh fruity and floral fruity fragrances for springtime so this is mask mood again this one too has um average projection average sillage it has longevity four to five hours this doesn't last so much too but for the price i don't you can reapply okay um the next one that i have i'm going very fast because i have quite let me see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen fragrances so i want to go really fast so the next one is uh, a marv's eternal and eternia this is beautiful this is actually an all year round fragrance this some people say it's a dupe for um dior poison i am not so sure because I, I i think it's similar it is actually similar I, it reminds me i've smelled the dior poison before so it reminds me so this is very beautiful it has a bit of um some nuttiness to it because it has almonds to it it's very beautiful classy put together when i think of this fragrance i think of like a beautiful floral dress with you know off shoulder i'm gonna put a picture of the dress and you wear this classy with some really nice wedges on this is like the scent that i think of and this is um this also has the same level medium to average projection medium to average sillage and then six five to six hours longevity on the skin that is our Marv's Eternia. Um, this other one that, that I'm going to take is um, another Latafa. And this is also a mask-based Latafa. This is, um, this I really love. It's called Rout Owl Mask, okay? Latafa's Rout Owl Mask. This is so beautiful. This is also another, let me see. Yep, this is a very fruity, floral, musky, scent very very beautiful if it, it's so juicy it's it has it gives me this um l'imperatrice toi kind of vibe it's very very fruity juicy fruity musky you know that kind of vibe that's what i get from here i'm not saying it's a dupe but this is a bit more floral there's this nice floral thing going on something like lily of the valley or yelang yelang going on with it that makes it really really beautiful I really like this one. This one too, you can see that I've used it a bit. Yes, so it's really, really, really beautiful, this. The next one that I have, this is um, called Berries Weekend. It's for my children. It's called Pink Edition, but I enjoy it. It's like a berry floral scent, very juicy, very, really nice. This, I'm thinking that this is going to be for like late spring when summer is about to come in, but it's not yet summer, but you're getting the summer vibes. This is a very nice way to ushering summer in the spring, you know, when you're just closing off into summer. Very beautiful. I smell strawberries, I smell raspberries. Very, very juicy with a floral background, like something white floral. 
with vanilla with amber too very beautiful it's very popular and there's a tad like a drizzle of incense in it that, that's for me is what makes it really unique unfortunately that's what makes it slightly challenging for the girls so they tend to go for this small i don't know what <laughs> this this is another one that i got for them this is the victoria secret body mist but they tend to prefer this than um this just because of the incense but it's really beautiful it's a summer spring fragrance with like a twist to it and so that's why like i really enjoy this one um i have um the cult favorite which is a uh, club de nuit woman this is a floral beautiful citrus like scent all year round scent but very beautiful if you're somebody that doesn't want something too floral something too fruity this is very beautiful classy is a dupe of chanel's coco mademoiselle this is quite beast mode this is one of the beast mode ones and this one projects it has a huge projection it has a huge sillage lasts seven to eight hours even sometimes 10 hours on the skin so this is clap de nuit woman by amarf the next one is going to be another favorite of mine and this is Dalham wadi this is so so beautiful it is very beautiful Dalham wadi it's floral beautiful non-offensive white floral a bit fruity a bit citrusy just really super beautiful for spring like if you're looking for something to start spring off with Dalham Wadi is your fragrance. I know that, like, I, I haven't, I say so much about Dalham Wadi because it smells so many. First of all, most of these fragrances, I'll say that they're fragrances that if you're looking for fragrances that have a non Middle Eastern DNA, so fragrances that don't smell Middle Eastern, these are your fragrances right here, okay? Um, the next one that I'm going to go for is this. I haven't shared this before. This is called Sumu it's so beautiful like i'm i'm this is my second bottle of this fragrance i'm obsessed it's my happy fragrance i haven't talked a lot about this fragrance i don't know maybe i didn't feel like i should share it with anybody but i like this scent it's very on my skin it's like fruity it's fresh it's light it's upbeat it has a background of some florals in it it gets a bit green but it's so beautiful. I know that somebody mentioned in one video a long time ago that it was a dupe of um, a Dior. I'm going to try and say the name of the Dior. This thing has two bottles. So the first one I bought was called Samu. And then instead of SU, and then I'm going to put a comparison of those two bottles somewhere so that you can see on the screen. And then it later became this. And my d dealer said this was like dealer like i do my supplier not dealer <laughs> said that this was like the new version of it but if you can find this get your hands on it it's very beautiful and inexpensive the next one is uh ma mas okay yeah mazaji this one c chronicles i saw a video of c chronicles and she loved it and i got it and i haven't regretted so this is a rose you can see there's a big rose here but this is a rose mainly rose based scent that is at the background of some fruits and the white florals very beautiful very mature this is i don't find this as a, um, a young people scent so if you're one that enjoys a scent that is matured and put together and this is a great scent for spring this one right here for me is people that like super fruity fragrances for spring and this is um, Amarv's Le Femme for on my skin it's bright crisp apples and when I think of spring picnics and all that I think of apples and all that I think this is great for spring especially spring evenings when it's a bit cool and especially around early spring I think that Amarv's Le Femme is going to be really cool for that the last one that I have is one that I'm super confused about this is a Modest Queen Perform. And you know, there's Modest Perform, which I'm going to put the picture up here. And um, so my friend Jasmine had seen this at one of her suppliers. And that same weekend, I also saw it at mine. And then I got it. Only for her to DM Amarv to ask about it. And they said that they were it. I mean, Afnan. And they said they knew nothing about it. But it was online where Jasmine was trying to buy it. And my suppliers also had it. So what I want to say is that, look, this thing is good. It has floral it has patchouli 
it has some vanilla or raisin thing going there amber woodiness it's so beautiful you can see how much i've used of it and but they said they don't know anything about it to be super honest but i like the scent so i'm keeping it and this is beautiful 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 for spring so very quickly i've gone through 16 fragrances that i have that are very perfect for spring they're also inexpensive fragrances so if you have other fragrances that you use in springtime that i haven't talked about that i don't own can you just talk to me in the comment section thank you so much for your constant support and your constant you know just being here i really appreciate it. i can't say thank you enough so thank you very much for watching this video. Stay safe and stay centered.